All right, quick documentary, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? So, here it is, this little bean head, and came back. Then you got the people who living in the parking lot, doing their thing, you know what I'm saying? Shirtless wonder with a cigarette in his mouth and a bandana. Now, just coincidental, there was a guy, on a, a black guy on a bike that just rolled by. Now, yesterday, I had to tell this guy right here to get out my way because I was about to get on the bike. And he was literally standing, like, literally right in front of the bikes, like, I right. Hey, look, man, I'm trying to work out. I don't need nobody, like, crowd in my area, all in my space. Go ahead and get out the way. Like he's doing right now, getting out the way. But he still got his headphones on. You know. And, you know, he was just acting like a tough guy. And look. Coincidentally, there's two Chrysler 200s going right by. It's two. One 200. The second 200. They both got baskets. One got a basket in the back, and the other one does not. You know what I'm saying? So, oh, it's three of them. Cause if a Chrysler 300 pops up, bro, I'm done. <laughs> there's three Chryslers, right? Uh, 200s. So maybe a Chrysler 300 might pull up. And, bro, I, I promise you, man, I be seeing some of these folks. And, oh, yeah, he got the itch. He got the junky itch. He trying to connect. I be seeing some of these people, bro. And I'm like, how did, I mean, not to say I'm jealous or anything of the sort, but it's like, bro, I know some of y'all is smoking dope and doing all kind of crazy crap, right? How is y'all still... <laughs> Like, functioning, you know what, I be catching these folks, these be the people be nodding out at job, doing all kind of crazy crap, right? Speedballing, you know, they got to steady getting geeked or whatever to do their job, whatever, right? And I'm like, bro, how is it somebody who's not trying to do nothing, that, just trying to go to work, trying to do what he does, and do the job and go home, not stress about the money and none of that stuff, trying to have him enjoy his time, be getting Chopped at the knee so much. But then, you know, I, I got to think back to what God says, man, what Christ wrote in the word. This will happen to you. Anybody who's doing things that is not of the norm, they got to crush it. It makes people, it rubs people the wrong way, bro. Especially when you got a lot of eyes on you, bro. Like, Truth be told, and you know what? I also seen all that stuff that's on his, all these emblems, bro. Like it, 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 it tells you what these people are, bro. But you know, and you'll say, "Oh, he's just a dog lover." But it has a lot of stuff has deeper meaning, like that that show Westworld and all that. A lot of these shows have deeper meanings. It goes deeper than that. It's programming. A lot of people, you know what? A lot of people get on here and be talking that crazy crap. They don't do no type of reading. They just do their research off of just listening to other folks. I have literally read these books on a lot of this stuff. And it breaks down indefinitely like how they try to program people and get them to do certain things and certain colors and certain codes do things to the mind. And it makes you react and do certain things, bro. It's just... It just is what it is. You know how you know that? Because they've been studying us for a long time. And if you got wicked spirits that study you, and then they teach it to wicked people, like wicked men and women, it gets deeper than that, bro. Like, they, they get to studying you. Then they try to figure out your patterns. All right. So if this is not the case, why does the police do the same thing? When a police officer is investigating you or watching you or say the CIA or whatever, whatever agency it is, they send operatives out to watch you, see what you're going to do, see how you react. Then they stalk you. Then they harass you to see how you're going to move so they can predict and counter predict your actions. This is what you call watching film. You do it in sports. You watch film. You study your opponent. 
What did they do to Christ? They studied him. They was watching him. They wanted to corner him. Christ was just like, bro, y'all can't keep up with me. I'm with God. And he he had he already knew what he had to came for. He had to fulfill what he had to fulfill. So he was like, bro, it's not that y'all getting me. It's, it's what I had to do. I came here to do this. So it was like, all right. I mean, it's not like y'all getting one up by crucifying me, bro. It's the whole basis of me coming. And people don't, people don't realize it. And I just had like about a dozen of these folks vaping around me. I don't know what's going on with this vape, 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 vape. Everybody want to vape. And everybody know it's bad for them. Look at the seagulls. Look at that movie called Birds. I don't know if y'all ever seen that movie Birds. Birds. You ever seen that? Movie called Birds. Somebody behind me is another two black dudes. It's a lot of stuff going on. A lot of stuff going on. Well, yeah, like I was saying, it's just like every type of well-known prophet or anybody like they literally watched and stalked the crap out of them they wanted to see them flop they they wanted to see some type of weakness because they wanted to tear it down bro they wanted to kill them at any chance they got like they all be wanting to kill something man because it's going to expose their regime their agenda Whatever that person in them is really doing, like, bro, you foul. And most of the time, like, you know what I'm saying? Look, most times when you, when a person wakes up and comes into the knowledge of certain people being a part of things and being, like, super foul and, like, setting them up, they come back aware. Oh, it's like they can't beat them now as they want to, but they want to kill them all. Like, if I can't kill you, I destroy everything. If I can't destroy everything, I'm going to either kill myself <laughs> Uh, you know what I'm saying? Try to kill something next to you. Bro. It's just, it's just how it go. They want, they want to blow it all up, bro. And it's just not to be cold and Tupac, but like it's just the way it is, man. And you know that was a deep song because uh, I believe that's uh, is that the one with the video. Whatever video it is, I don't remember which one it is, but when he has the homeboy, they was down for each other, and then he realized, like, bro, it was a snake at the end, like, and he died for, I believe he died for him or whatever. He's like, man, he wasn't even tripping on him, like, bro, that's just the way it is. <laughs> Not to be, you know what I'm saying, but that's just a quick analogy. People just out here just doing whatever, man. And it doesn't make sense. Because it's like, bro, none of this stuff has to be how it is. People could do better, strive for better. Like, people just greedy, bro. It's a lot of people out here that are really just greedy and they only care about themselves. Actually, they only care about having the stature of having other people care about what they have. So they really just want to have all the stuff so people can admire them and make them feel good. They want to be idolized because that seems like it's cool. So they get big old trucks with big old wheels. And a lot of times, some of these people don't even like this stuff. Mind you, they don't even know nothing about the stuff. They don't even like it. They don't even know about the upkeep and none of that stuff. They just get it. So they can try to shine and crap on somebody. Look what I got you, boy. You ain't got this. And don't get me wrong, because, like, it'd be cool when you just playing around with your people, whatever, like, and y'all both seeing where y'all came from, whatever. It's like, all right. But when you doing it just to really just... You know what I mean? Try to make people jealous and blow people days and stuff. Bro, you you a, you a real sucker. Because at the end of the day, somebody going to come through with something better than yours. 
and it's gonna ruin your day. And you're gonna be like, man, bro. And look, peep gang, do y'all not realize how many red cars that just pulled up over here? Like, it was a challenger, a red, a red Jeep, a red van, uh, a red charger. And look, they fool act like they, they, he over here catching a play. And this fool alarm going out. Like, come on, bro. I ain't even got to make the block hot and say the block ain't hot. And he look like he supposed to be in the chain gang or something, bro. Get out of here, bro. And what I just said about the vape, he vaping. <laughs> he vaping. Like, come on, bro. I look, look, we, we just gonna keep watching. Just keep watching. I look. Yeah. He dropped the cigarette out of his car. I want y'all to zoom. See this cigarette right here. The cigarette right here, right? He got a cigarette in his mouth here across the way. He didn't lean back, so you can't see him now. He got a cigarette in his mouth, though. You can see it. Got a cigarette in his mouth. And look, there's somebody going across the way. And he vaping. Do you not? Come on, bro. Like, is that coincidental? Like, he's vaping. He's vaping. These two are smoking cigarettes, but they ain't they ain't fired them up, though. And dude walking across the way. And they go bust it up. Uh, bust it up car in the silver car. Man. Across from the other busted up car. They joint busted up and the silver car busted up. I mean, how ironic is that? And they go to yellow. The scene about to stop in a minute, bro. I guarantee they're gonna they're gonna start to play over again. Cause look, that's the blue. Blue. They go to green. They go black, red, blue, green, yellow. That's like a type of yellow. You'll say yellow or orange, or whatever. But it's over with. Like I just said, look, they play. Their transaction is done. Here comes another scene. They about to switch the whole scene. Watch. He about to go do some nonsense. He's gonna come back. They go. What I just said about to do some nonsense and come back. And I just said the military. That dude's a uh, a vet. The BMW just came back and went around the corner. He a vet. He going that way. And he's sneezing like crazy. Ring around the rosy. He about to run the same thing, bro. Somebody coming. It's always the same stuff. I ain't like, we're all connected, man. Nah, y'all want us all connected so we can be with, chained in with this weird crap. Here it goes again. She looking so evil, like, why? Maybe the sun was in her eyes. Let me not say she was looking evil. Maybe she was just, you know, squinting up because of the sun. Let's see. Now she almost looked identical to the chick that worked at the other Planet Fitness. I promise you, she almost looked like a twin. And you know they gotta bring out the big butt. And there you go, big booty white girl on the scene. She working the block. She hot it's out of here. And she got all the stickers on the back of her chain. I don't trust nobody with them stickers, bro. You got all these emblems and stuff, man. Like, bro. I don't trust none of that. It's always got to have somebody talking loud outside. It's always. Hey, look. And they go that red challenger or whatever they call it. They always got to talk loud. Put on. Bro. I kid you not. I have never seen so many busted up cars in my life. As a kid, I, I don't ever remember seeing this many broke down cars, man. I, I thought it was like a law against us. But everybody got broke cars. So I'm going to say 
Bloody about to return. I think he about to come back. Little buddy in the black and white. He about to shoot back. Somebody coming through. He looking for somebody to juice. How many beamers gonna come in in just that short amount of time, bro? So much beamers. Challenge. What's the challenge? What's the challenge? It's a challenge. I already know what the play is. I'm dealing with that. It's a challenge. He just got cool, too. It's a challenge. There you go. I just said he just got cool. He just drunk some juice. What's the challenge? Challenge, 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 challenge. Keep you cool. A man walk to Dollar General to get a gator, baby. Another beamer, 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 beamer. The sad thing about it, I ain't even gonna post this. I'm gonna, I'm gonna post this later on. I ain't gonna keep posting all of them. It's like, bro, I don't even wanna post these joints here. I, you know what? Yeah, that's what we do. 